Hi everyone, so today I've got another unboxing video for you. Oh my gosh. Hopefully this is not like too frequently. I've just got a ton of boxes piling up here and I want to open them so I thought I would just do it. Some of you really like these videos, some of you don't. If you don't like them, don't watch them. It's as simple as that. Okay, so I've got another Body Shop box. In the Body Shop uh, package, I have the Chamomile Sumptuous Cleansing Butter. So that's interesting, a cleansing butter. I guess this is to remove um, your makeup. Okay, I only know the body butters from them, so I've never tried this, but it's supposed to be for makeup removal. It says that upon application, it turns into an oil, and that is supposed to help remove the makeup. So yeah, I mean, it does turn into an oil, but how are you supposed to get it from here on your face? Are you just supposed to slather it on? I'm not really sure how to use this, to be honest. Um, it smells nice doesn't really smell like chamomile though, in my opinion. I mean, chamomile to me has a very distinct scent, like the chamomile tea, and this, this doesn't really smell like chamomile. So I don't know, I guess I'm gonna try this out. I'm actually pretty curious to try this out because I like the idea of a cleansing oil. So I guess a cleansing butter is gonna be working in the same way. So thank you so much to Body Shop. Okay, so the next box is by Ella Masca. It's from the Paranormal Collection. All right, so here is a little booklet, and I really like their booklets because they always have really gorgeous makeup by Alex Box in it. And they have just gorgeous visuals from the collection. Wow, those are really pretty. So first, there is the Paranormal Palette. Okay, so this is a quad, I guess. It's an eyeshadow palette. Ooh, okay, that's quite bright. Um, wow, how fun. So there's four eyeshadows in here, like a bright green, a purple, an orange, and a pink up there. And they look really kind of shimmery. Ooh. Okay, I'm trying to figure out this texture is really strange. I can't tell if this is a powder eyeshadow or a cream eyeshadow. It's like a really satiny texture that's really cool. Okay, so there's also a lipstick in here. In... ESP, 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 I don't know. There's the lipstick bullet. I really like the Elamasca lipstick bullets. I think they're quite fancy. Whoa, what the, oh my God, can you see that? Wow, that is crazy. Let's check that out. Bright purple lipstick, that is so funky. Wow, that looks so fun. I can't wait to play with that. That looks really cool. And then there's also another product in here and it doesn't have anything on it. It doesn't have a writing or anything on it. I'm guessing it's a gel liner, a black gel liner. Yeah, I don't know what this product is. It's a black gel liner, I guess. So thank you to Elamasca for the products. I think I am most excited about the Paranormal palette. Um, because the texture seems really new to me. Like I don't have any eyeshadows that have this kind of texture. So I'm curious to try that. The lipstick looks really cool. And I'm also kind of curious about the Hydra Veil, like this watery jello consistency thing, um, cause that seems kind of neat. So the next box I've got here doesn't have a return address on it. Um, so I don't even know who it is from. Oh, okay. So this is, I think L'Occitane again. Oh, that's cute. There's this little basket inside. I think that I'm going to be able to reuse that for my bathroom or something, definitely. Um, so there is the little wicker basket. It is real wicker, so that's that's cool. Um, and then inside is the Vervain uh, shower gel in fresh, yeah, just a fresh shower gel. Mm, it smells really nice. It's their typical Vervain scent. So it smells really fresh. It smells very, very light, fresh, citrusy. This looks like it could be a really good shower gel. And then there's also the Vervain Eau de Toilette. Mm, I love it. It's so citrusy. Yummy, it smells really good. I love this scent though. So that is from L'Occitane. If you like, <coughs> okay. Don't talk after you spray perfume because I got it in my mouth. I'm better now. So thank you so much to Luxitan. I really love that stuff and I can't wait to use it. The last package 
is by OCC and it is a huge package. Holy crow, this package is like pretty deep and it is just jam packed with OCC products. Holy crow, so wow, okay, there's a whole brush set in here by OCC, the Obsessive Compulsive Cosmetics. I think it's this brand is from, well, somewhere in the States, I don't know if it's California or somewhere. And I think they, all their stuff is like vegan friendly, so none of it is like animal cruelty. Um, and I think these brushes are obviously then synthetic. That wouldn't make sense for them to sell real hair brushes. Let's see. Oh, they feel really soft. They do feel synthetic, but they do feel really, really soft. There's no numbering system on them, so I can't even like tell you what they are. They do have really cute white handles though. This one looks like a really good contouring brush. Like you could totally use that to, you know, go underneath your cheekbones and holy crow. Okay, so there's tons of brushes in here. Um, there's a good like a blending like for the crease like this. Whoa, okay, oh my god, I don't even know what to show you first. There's like, there are pigments in here. I think these are called the loose color concentrates. Whoa, they sent me so many of them. Holy smokes, okay. Whoa, lip tars. <laughs> More lip tars. And these are the lip tar stain gloss. I think these are new to their range. So the lip tars, I can maybe just explain to you, those of you who don't know these, these are intensely pigmented lip products that you just apply with a lip brush and you honestly need the tiniest amount. Like you don't apply it straight to your lips. Like you're not gonna go like this and you know, put it on like this cause you'll get way too much. You'll get like a pea sized drop of it, put it on the back of your hand, use the lip brush and then paint it on. And they are just really, really cool colors. Like look at this, this one is called Yaoi. Okay, this one that I just showed is Divine. And they have some really cool colors. So there's like a bright yellow. So um, this one's called Traffic. And some of you would be like, well, why would I need a yellow, like, I mean, unless you're wearing yellow lipstick. I mean, you can mix all these together. So you can, you know, if you want, for example, this pink to be a little bit more orangey, then you would add some yellow to it and that'll kind of make it a bit like a coral color. So I guess these products are really great for makeup artists and especially to those people who like to mix their custom shades. And also you need to kind of know the color wheel because you'll know you'll need to kind of know uh, what to mix with what to get a certain result that you're after. So holy smokes, there's tons of lip tars in here. Um, yeah, I'm really excited to try that. There's more lip tars in here. I don't know if this is their entire range, but it looks like there's a lot in here. This one's called Clockwork and this one is called Annika. And there's a bunch more. I guess these are supposed to be meant to be like nude shades, but you could certainly custom mix these. Like if you have a white, for example, like this, you can lighten up any of these shades. So this is Anime. You just would get a little bit. You see the tiny drop that I have put on the back of my Oops, on the back of my hand. Just pick it up the color from here. You see how much lip product that makes? That's probably enough to cover your entire lip. That's really fun, like a bright blue glitter. So there's actually a ton in there. Obviously I can't show you them all because that will take forever. Wow, this one is awesome. Look at this. This is called Pure Pigment in Royal Blue. Oh, I love this color. Can you see that? It's like bright blue. <gasps> wow, pigmentation is fantastic. I just got like a tiny little bit of it. And this is a matte one, so that is quite intense. It looks like it, it's a little bit chalky though, but I'll have to see how that works on the eye. For example, this one's called just turquoise, which is a nice teal green. There's a good purple in here called magenta. Ooh, I can't wait to use these to do like a super colorful look. Cherry Bomb. Do you see that? It's like a nice pink. Um, so this is the Lip Tar Stained Gloss in New Wave. So let's get a little bit of that. You can see that. Yeah, this is definitely just a lip gloss. And it has a menthol or like a mint, not menthol, it has like a mint flavor. So that is also kind of unique. This is, yeah, definitely more like a stain, like a lip stain. Oh, I'm so excited. I can't wait to try out these awesome products. Thank you so, so much to OCC. 
Um, I will definitely be using these, obviously, in tutorials because you, you guys know I like to do really colorful looks sometimes. And I think these will be perfect for doing like crazy colorful makeup. Look at this mess now all over my floor. It's like <laughs> stuff lying everywhere. I have to organize it. Ah! Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, um, subscribe to my channel and leave me a comment down below. You can also uh, give me a like in the thumbs up down there. I appreciate that so much. And thank you to all the companies who sent me their samples. Yeah, thanks so much guys and I'll see you later. Bye!